Hello guys, Pacey McPete here, bringing you uh, a brand new game. Well, it's not a new game, but it's it's new to the channel. So, uh, this is Sword Art Online Lost Song. Uh, for those of you who don't know, Sword Art Online is quite a, a popular anime about a, um, a a virtual reality MMO game called Sword Art Online. Um, it's basically a full body VR experience thing. Uh, yeah, obviously I don't have VR, but they've turned it into a game anyway. So, it's really cool, you can like fly around and stuff. So, let's just, I don't know much about it. I've not, I've not played any of the story. I've literally, like, opened the game, played the tutorial, and this is where it's put me. And the floating town of Rhine. I don't know what I'm supposed to do, but let's go fight some things. I just love flying. Flying is quite cool in this. Oh, oh, I got a quest marker. Wait. That's not a quest marker, that's the inn. I just came from there. No, it's not, that's a weaponsmith. This is the town shop. We can craft equipment as well as buy and sell items here. It's currently being renovated, though. We'll have to wait to use it. Okay. Yeah, unfortunately, the game is in Japanese, just with so the audio is in Japanese uh, with English subtitles. We'll just have to make do. Yeah, let's go on our next adventure. Yeah, ready when you are. Come on, shut up, guys. It's a party based thing, so you have um, a squad full of people who help you in combat. Oh no, don't want to do that. I don't know what I did. Let's go to Woglindy. Woglind? Woglindy? I don't know. The Island of Meadows. I've got really high hopes about this game. Our goal is the dungeon located to the northeast. Let's follow the market to our destination. So I want to display the skill menu. I have skills. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Good to know. There's quite a lot of enemies. Why are you flying? I want to fly. You've got two modes of flight. You've got um, either hover mode or, um, yeah, hover mode where you can uh, ascend and descend or you've got the speed flight mode where you actually fly. Uh, really fun thing to do is just fly up and then uh, exit and then try and catch yourself before you take fall damage. All right. Let's try and fight something. Oh god. The combat's quite fun, actually. Uh, you can dodge and counter. The enemies don't seem to be wanting to hit me at the moment. Oh, that guy did. Alright. The currency is Yuld, as you can see on the left hand side of the screen. Oh, what happened there? Did I level up? Yeah, I'm, I'm not really talking much. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm still trying to get used to the game myself. Oh, who are you? Can I can I speak to you? What happened there? Did I get healed? Mana crystal. Who are you? It'd be cool if you could PK in this game. I know that they're, they're NPCs, but. It's cool because you can you can fight either in the air or on the ground. Let's. Uh, I was supposed to dodge that. I forgot to dodge. It's cool how your party members are helping out. I've got Sinon. There's probably a, I'm probably pronouncing that wrong. Sinon and Asana. Both helping me at the minute. 
let's Yeah. That's a really cool ability. Yeah, there's quite a lot of damage. Yeah, it was quite an easy victory. I'm out of mana. Okay. Alright. She standard uh, similar combat to... Uh, oh, oh dear. Without the flying, it's kind of similar to... To the, the, the Deadpool style of combat is very flowing. Timing based, uh, square and triangle, and then circle to dodge. Right, that's, that's enough mindless killing. Let's uh, follow the blip on the map that way, head northeast. This way, there's a dungeon. The map is very, very small. Oh, so it's here. It doesn't look enterable at the minute. That's with the door. It appears to be sealed by magic. So in other words, we can't just kick it down. We won't be able to go any further until we do something about it. Probably a hidden lever, but where could it be? It seems to be a strange hole. It looks promising me to stick a piece of stone. All right. Looking for an object. Oh. The Fields of Thor. Fields of Thor refers to that farm. You might find clues on how to open this door there. Let's check it out. Okay. She sounds so... Oh, there's a wall there. Alright, where am I going? Where am I going? That way. Oh, God. The controls are a little bit dodgy. I've got them on inverted because it's just seemed a bit easier. Ah, uh, so this is where I gotta go. There seems to be quite a few enemies around here. Uh, and yes, it's it's fine. We we got this. A monster has appeared. Quite a few monsters have appeared. Oh, these are all really weak monsters. I don't even know what these monsters are. I don't think it actually says. Alright, that's quite a difficult one to... Unless you're locked on. It makes you feel like a badass. Right. <sighs> Looks like that was the last of them. Yeah, we did. They had the numbers, but they were pretty weak. If they were stronger, we would have been in trouble. It means things are going to get a lot harder from here on out. It might just be a challenge. These guys are pushovers, but we'll soon face stronger and more fearsome monsters. You're enjoying this, aren't you? There's a lot of talking in this game. I got interested in Alfheim Online almost immediately after I returned from Soda Online and was discharged from the hospital. Oh, cutscene. I had just moved back home and was finally getting used to living in the real world again. Kazuto, do you have a minute? Yeah, that's Sugaha, my sister. Uh, her character's name is Leifa. She's one of the players who survived Sword Art Online with me. Remember the other VR MMO I used to play? You mean ALO, Alpha I'm Online? That's the game where you could fly, right? There were wars between different races and so on. Right, it was built off a copy of the Sword Art Online servers. That's my girlfriend, Asano, Yuki. I met her in SAO. We got mixed up in some crazy stuff, good and bad. But when all was said and done, we formed an unbreakable bond. Oh, that's nice. We experienced things we'd rather forget. Some of the horrors we faced almost broke our bodies and our minds. We fought for two years before we gained our freedom, but those years had meaning and we won't forget that. World famous internet idol 7, actually genius scientist. 
Ah, sorry, I'm getting bored of this. I hope you're not interested in the story. Too much talking. All of the talking, right. Let's try a little harder, what we gotta do? Ooh, that's cool. Dead. D -e -d. Oh, now what? Look, more players. Oh, someone's catching up. Time to hustle. Alright. He ran off. With the way they were fighting, I'm guessing they were pretty seasoned gamers. Any part that's made it this far has to be pretty good. Let's go. Too much talking. That's one... One minor fault to this game. There's, at the minute, there's too much talking. That could be because it's the intro. And this is still relatively, like... Tutorial like. I I dodged that. Alright. Come on. Get the thing. Get the thing. No, I don't want to do that. Get, why am I targeting? Thank you. Examine the thing. I got four sharp claws. Good to know. Right. I've missed all of them. That was awful. Yeah. Right. What have I actually got to... Ah, there's a blip on the map. Go inside the farmhouse. That would make sense. Maybe we can find some clues. Let's give this place a thorough search. Oh, there's a chest. Chests are always helpful. Yay, healing potion. Ooh. Is that a back entrance? It's pretty run down. I'm guessing it's been abandoned for some time. Now, now what? Oh, the flight's really annoying because at point it, you start flying whichever direction your character's facing, not whichever way your camera's facing, which is a bit annoying. This looks very badly textured. It won't. It's locked. It won't open. That now, now what? What are you? Look, a key. Oh, that's helpful. You got a key build sinker or something. Hurry up and open the door. Let's go. Open sesame. Hey, it's the lump of rock. Look about half the... Oh, great. There's another half. Good eye, Leaf. I'm sure we can find a hint in there. It's pretty old, but it looks legible. I'm going to read it. Great. No, I broke my stone tablet. My family's protected for generations. Oh, dear. The Wyvern stole one of the two halves of the tablet. I can't let anyone find out. I'm taking the secret to my grave. My end draws nine. Still, my darkest secret remains buried. Still, I wish only that someone would find the missing piece and restore my family's heirloom. Well. Sounds like we can find the piece of the tablet to find this Wyvern. You be any idea where to look? It appears the Wyvern lives on another floating island to the north of here. To the island to the north. Sweet. Right. Let's go. Head off to the north. Too much talking. Oh, this is the island. Ooh, this is the floating island the general mentioned, where we can find this wyvern thing. Oh, looks like it found us. Oh, there's three of them. Ah. See, the difference between wyverns and dragons is uh, 
Wyverns, their wings are their front arms, whereas dragons have four legs and wings. That's that's the, the apparent difference between the two. Let's do it. Let's kill this Wyvern. Deal all the damage. Where did he go? Where did he go? It's down there. Oh god. Is that all you got? Well, it seemed to be enough. The enemy is nearly finished. How is he nearly finished? Oh. Well, that was easy. Oh, wait. There's two more. These Wyverns seem, seem pretty easy to kill. One left. Come on. There we go. Yay! Victory fist bump. Yay! We did the quest. But I thought the quest was to get through the door. Yay! Congratulations. Do I get something cool for it? We did it! Great work. Yeah, yeah, standard victory stuff. Yeah, we got the other half. Should be able to open that door now, finally get into that dungeon. Yay, we got the tablet. So, we need to go to that dungeon now, but that is something for the next episode. So, yeah, that was uh, Sword Art Online The Lost Song. Uh, yeah, leave a like if you liked what you see, and subscribe if you want to subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video.